We're going to be putting discoveries out from this place that are a result of intense R&D. We're going to train young people. We're going to build up the next cohort of designers and engineers and technology folks. You know, OMIC is a place where we collaborate. We bring universities, industry, government, philanthropy together to try and promote economic development. Where we have that center that we can go to to try things, to learn new things, to support the education curriculums that we really need. It's a true investment statewide in manufacturing. Well, initiatives like OMIC are always a three-way partnership. It is government, it is industry, and it is academia. And it's by bringing them together, which is not always easy, but bringing them together that's the way you make the big steps forward. Our principal partners are industry because we want to pioneer techniques and technologies here that then can go into industry supply chain. Get the right people doing the right things for the right reasons. From the chairman of the board right through to those youngsters we serve, all these people get it and are doing the things for the right reasons having an R&D center, having the PCC OMIC training center right nearby, that's the equation that allows you to have businesses grow here knowing that they'll have technical assistance when they need it and good workforce to take advantage of. We're doing something here that has potential impact much beyond Columbia County and has interest from around the world. So I see the opportunity of not only just creating technology, we could become the nucleus of a technological park, an innovation park, with all other partners located around us. We seem to have a collaboration spirit that exists here, that there's enough benefit for all the parties involved. They can collaborate together and build something bigger they couldn't do on their own. We're trying to set up an ecosystem of engaging students in the grade schools, the high schools, we have several intern programs that are done in conjunction with the universities. Really having OMIC invest as well, side by side with companies in that education and in getting that message out to people that there are wonderful careers in manufacturing is critical. It's critical to the whole state of Oregon as we build out manufacturing here and continue to invest in the state. I'm a chemical engineering student at OSU, and this has been such a great program because I've learned a lot of hands-on experience in the manufacturing environment. I get to come out here and do the things that you read in the textbook, and even sometimes I get to expand the textbook a little bit and, and add information to the knowledge pool. This is a, such a broad um, spectrum of being able to go to any type of manufacturing, medical side, and build things. And OMIC really shows how broad of what mechanical engineering can be. The biggest achievement we've got here is attracting and enticing a next generation of engineers. Without that, there is no industry. We need them like we need fresh air. In the long run, for us to be successful, we have to demonstrate not that we're just helping the backbone of Oregon's economy and manufacturing, but that we're helping to transform it so that it's able to be a force multiplier in the way Oregon competes in the world market. The fact that we're contributing and trying to revitalize an industrial landscape is enormously meaningful to me personally, as well as my life as a former legislator but moreover my life as an Oregonian. I want to be proud of this place. The incredible part of OMIC is really the future looking vision where we get to say, we're recognizing you because you're really taking us someplace wonderful. So OMIC brings the latest in technologies, the very best in people, and of course our students who are very excited to learn new and bigger and better things. And this is where the passion, talent, and the need come together and innovation happens at the intersection of these three.